Hi YouTubers, um, this is Menace 358 Just giving you an update on my uh, bronze quarries and they seem to be doing fine They're in my sun um, There's at least 20 or more probably 30 in that in there somewhere You can see in the foreground there um, They're just sifting through some zeolite sand and uh, they seem to be quite happy I don't think they're going to breed anymore because there's quite a lot in there and they'll probably just cannibalize any eggs that they might breed. Um, that's one of the larger adults there and um, next to it is one of its offsprings. So now what I've done is I've thrown in some blood worms and how they feed is uh, I actually won't go and grab the blood worm but they'll just wait until it settles to the bottom. Once it settles to the bottom, bottom they'll just sift through the sand and just catch the blood worms. Bronze quarry being bronze quarries, they just they're basically uh, bottom feeders. And there they are coming out. They're quite shy. You can see the blood worms there. There's about five in that group there. They're actually hard to film because they're quite fast. There's a smaller version there. He's within the Java moss there. You can see him just grabbing the blood worms there. Quite cute actually. There you go, there's a colony of about seven there. Um, all on the sand. And he was just munching away there, taking their time. In terms of plants, it's the same old plants. Java fern, Anubis, Java moss, and probably some uh, lucky bamboo just floating on the top, which seems to be still surviving. Quite healthy, aren't they? You can see some there hiding between behind the plants. Just gonna focus it. There you go. The Java moss is actually growing quite quite um, fast. Being a low light setup, um, there's only one light bulb. It would do so. And um, you can see the bronze quarry there just nibbling away. Being right at home in this setup. And there you go, there's a whole heap there. Still nibbling away at the um, blood worms. Two, four, six, at least six there. Probably some hiding at the back near the plants. There's one more right in the corner there with the, uh, the pump. With this setup, it's good to have plants, especially Java moss. Um, it helps them uh, give them a sense of security and uh, gives them heaps of hiding places. And if they do breed, it gives a chance for the um, babies to naturally escape from the parents. Um, whether they, they're going to be successful or not is a different question, but yeah, Java Moss is great for that. And you can see that they're just, they were just sitting still there. I'm pretty sure they're aware of my presence, so every movement I make, they just um, stay completely still. Okay, here's some close-up of some of the quarries. Plenty of food there for them to eat, as you can see. It's how wonderful that they've grown for such a small thing to 
that size now. And all they've known is just life in this sump, basically. Well, thanks for watching my uh, bronze quarries. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, and please subscribe and like. Thanks.